Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ebony and today I'm going to be doing a what my twin sisters are getting for Christmas video. I have been like binge watching these types of videos on YouTube and I just thought now that we're done with my twin sisters um, gifts it would be nice to like record my own video to like you know have on my channel in case someone is like me and enjoys watching these types of videos. Um, so my twin sisters Kaylee and Kylie are two years old. They're They'll be, well, they're barely three. They'll be three in January. Um, and yeah, like they're just girly girls. So a lot of the things on here are like girly girl gifts. But um, I thought that this would line up well with my channel because as you guys know, I'm very like frugal and I like to make sure that I'm getting the most for my money. So as you will see in this video, um, the twins will definitely be getting some things that are thrifted, some things that are secondhand. And then... Um, they're blessed enough to come from like a three income family because there's my brother and I were both college students and we work. Um, and then of course there's my mom. So they kind of get spoiled from all three of us who just all want us, want them to have like the best Christmas ever. Um, my brother and I, we grew up together of course, cause we're like really close in age. So we had really big Christmases growing up as kids. So now that we have our younger siblings, we want them to also experience the same joy and like the childhood fun of just being a child and having like this big extravagant Christmas. So we all kind of contributed to this. But um, you know, I'll give everyone their credit for what is here. Most of the stuff is for my mom and I will say the stuff that I picked out for them and the stuff that my brother picked out for them. So because we have so much to go through, like this is actually ridiculous. We have so much to go through. So I'm just going to try to move quick. I'm not sure if I'm going to edit this video because I don't know if I'm going to feel like editing this video. So we are going to try to do this whether we have errors or not. And excuse the quality. This is a horrible quality. I'm using my webcam because my cameras, all three of them, just decided they all wanted to act up. So this is what we're dealing with. Okay. So the first thing that the twins are getting are these 28 inch Barbie dolls. Um, we found these in the Goodwill like maybe in October, a few months ago. And um, we were just hoping that the kids didn't um, find it before Christmas came so that we can put it under the tree. And they were, they're still in sale at Walmart. Um, I think they're like 30, like 20 or $30, but we got them for $5 a piece. And they are just so cute. Um, and they're perfect for Christmas because they have their little shimmery dresses on. So I think these will just be so cute, like sitting on top of one of the boxes or something. So they're getting these. Okay. You gotta move quick because you guys, we have so much to go through. Okay, the next thing that they're getting are these Paw Patrol toys. And, uh-oh. Okay, they're getting these Paw Patrol toys. And I don't know, but... My sisters are obsessed with Paw Patrol right now. It's Paw Patrol, Doc McStuffins is huge in my house, and Minnie Mouse. So we found these Paw Patrol toys at Toys R Us. This is Sky's Deluxe Helicopter. Um, you press down on this button and the helicopter, the uh, what are these, the wings of the helicopter? Well, whatever this is, it um, spins around and it makes like the helicopter noise. And then this one is for Kaylee. And then for Kylie, she loves Marshall. That's her favorite character. They didn't have any deluxe Marshalls, anything. This is all they had with the character Marshalls, Marshall on it. So we got her this. But she has, like, fire trucks already. So she can play with her little Marshall with a bigger fire truck if she wanted to. Or she can play with the little one. But this is what the twins are getting. And I should also mention that we are not, we didn't get them a lot of the same things because they share a room and they play together very well and they share very nicely with each other. So it doesn't make sense to buy them two of the same exact things when we could buy them different things and they could have more to play with. So that's, that was our thinking in this Christmas. Okay, so the next thing that they have, um, my mom picked out for them. This is the, let me see, the almost on the go letters. Um, she is a preschool teacher. She has an at-home daycare, so she's big on education. Everything must have a purpose and a function, so she picked this out for them, and you just kind of match the letters in with, like, the little space that they go in, and then it kind of folds up like a book, and they can take it and walk around with it, but I thought that this would be, like, the perfect car toy. I'm always looking for things like this when I know I have to take the girls with me, so this will be perfect for them. Ooh, this is what I'm so excited about. Okay, 
So they are also getting this p big piano, well, this big keyboard. My brother and I had this toy growing up as kids, and it was probably one of my favorites. Um, you just put this down on the floor, and you walk across it, and you could just make all the little sounds or whatever with the notes or whatever that you're stepping on. Um, but this one, of course, is way more advanced than the one that my brother and I had because you can actually hook up your iPod or your MP3 player to it and play your own music and, like, make your own tune to it. And you can record... Um, and they have where you can play back. You can add drum, guitar, maracas, tambourines. Like, it's just so much going on. I'm most excited for them to open up this gift because I actually want to play with them with this. This looks so much fun. And it's just it's just going to remind me of, like, the one that my brother and I had as kids. So that's going to be so much fun to see them play with. Um, let me see. Next, my mom picked this up because she's also very extra. So she got them this Princess Palace with lights and what it is it's basically like a little canopy tent kind of thing that we can like pitch for them and maybe like their bedroom or in the living room and then you have like this little light that I guess goes at the top of it and it just like kind of gives them like a disco kind of I don't know if it's supposed to be twinkling I'm not sure what the light does but I don't know if it twinkles or what but they're gonna have so much fun dressing up in their like tutus and tiaras and just being princesses and like pretending and things like that that's just gonna be so cute to watch them play in that I'll put that on the floor okay the next thing that they're getting uh these are the ones that my brother picked out for them this is princess jazz this is princess tiana and this is princess jasmine um tiana is my favorite princess and jasmine well aladdin is my brother's favorite disney movie so i don't know if he realized that when he picked them up or he just picked up his favorite in, in another one but um yeah these are really cute so each of them will be getting a Disney princess. And then while we're on the doll theme, they will also be getting these. Um, obviously, we didn't plan this well because my, my mom and I, we kind of went out together and then my brother did his own thing. So they're also getting another princess Tiana doll. And then last night I entered into a raffle and I won like a basket full of like girl things and this was in there so I just decided to throw that into the the girls piles um oddly enough though my brother picked out the Walmart exclusive Tiana and then we picked out like the regular Tiana so they're gonna have both so each girl will have a princess Tiana doll and then we'll just get them like one will get the Jasmine and one will get the Barbie I really like these Barbies I was actually looking at these online and I thought about getting them for the twins because you have to watch Barbie. Sometimes her outfits are a little scandalous for me. I wouldn't want my child to play with them. I wouldn't want my sisters to play with them. But the fashionista Barbies, I noticed, like, if you look on the back, they all dress really cute and really appropriate and really, like, stylish. So I really like this line of the Barbie dolls. And I'm excited that I kind of, like, just got this one for free in my raffle because now they have one. Okay, let's come on over to here. This, the twins kind of picked out themselves. They are getting bath toys. They are obsessed with bath time. Like, we have to take the the plug out of the bathtub and let all the water drain out before they get out because they refuse to leave the bathtub. They have so much fun. Right now, they have, like, little boats and, like, little cups that they use to play with, but they've been asking for bath toys, and we just always forget to get them to get them for them so like what better time than Christmas so they have the little farm animal squirters of course my mom picked out the letters and numbers that kind of stick onto the um the tiles of the bathroom walls once it's wet and then they also have this paddling penguin so you kind of just pull this and it paddles through the water and you put the penguin in the boat or yeah the kayak whatever and that's just so cute and they're going to enjoy that at bath time the next thing that they have is this what is it roly pop toddler fun and um what it is is like they kind of they build or they construct this kind of maze thing and then they put the marble through and you can watch the maze like go through whatever puzzle you you made for it and then watch it come out and this promotes concentration and develops early engineering sense so you know my mama picked this up picked this out for them as well and I just think they're going to really enjoy this. And, like, my mom said some of the things they might share with the daycare kids. So I told you guys she has an at-home daycare. So this might be one of the things that comes down into the daycare for all the kids to enjoy. 
gonna put that on the floor too because it's kind of it's kind of big okay and the next thing that oh, oh okay the next thing that they have is this stacking neck nest sensory toys and these are just kind of like cups that they can play with i don't know if your twins i'm not your twins your toddlers or anything like my twin sisters but they love playing with things like cups and like brooms and uh, things like they're not supposed to play with so when we when my mom saw this she was like oh no they're getting this because they want to play with my cups so we're gonna give them some cups to play with for christmas so she found these these are from lakeshore and i think these are so cute they're probably going to be most excited about this this is so funny but i think it's really cute and i don't know let me see what it promotes uh, it doesn't really say what it promotes i think this is probably just for fun yeah it just might be just for fun so that's really cute and then they're also getting this my sweet baby honestly cute um baby doll they have this baby doll but they have the african-american one my twin sisters are a little they're either this color or might maybe a little bit lighter no they're about this color and um so we just got them something that they can like you know relate to they have this exact doll in um the african-american the, the darker the darker skin version and so now they have it both in the darker skin version and the lighter version which i think is really cute they love baby dolls they love playing mommy and things like that so they're going to enjoy that and they have they really didn't need any more barbie baby dolls because they actually do have a few quite a few but um yeah i guess my mom didn't remember they owned that one but i mean it's fine they don't own that exact one so it's cool um let me see like i said doc mcstuffins is huge in my house right now like she is she's the bomb right now so we found this doctor's bag set and basically they can pay, play doctor with one another and it has the doctor's bag it has a little thing that you look into the eyes the ears the mouth they have the um what is this called the therma what is it called when you check your temperature why can't i remember it the I forgot I forgot what it's called I can't the thermometer so it has a thermometer it has the little play needle it has the um, doctor's ID badge and it has a stethoscope and then they have little stickers down here that they can use as band aids which I think is really cute I'm so excited about this and then along with that I'll come back here and get the gift that's supposed to go with it so ugh, stay with it okay. So I told you guys that I found some things secondhand. I actually shopped on um, Facebook Marketplace and I found this. I really wanted them to have it, but Toys R Us doesn't carry it anymore because it's from last year. And um, someone sold this for $10 on Facebook Marketplace and all it needs is new batteries. And, excuse me, it came with um, Halle Hippo. And then this is, oh, in case you don't watch the show, this is Doc McStuffins, her um, mobile clinic. So she just walks around with this. She like wheels it around and she um, like fixes on toys and stuff. So it has the ladder, the light blinks or whatever. This opens up, even though it's kind of hard to open up, so I can't do that right now. Let me see. And then the back door of it opens. I'm trying to get it all in the frame. And then you kind of, let me see if I can get this together. And they have a little um, Lambie. So you open the back door, you pull out the little, the little tray thing that's down here. If I can get it together. Okay, so you pull this down. You have your little hospital bed and you can just wheel it up in there, close it up. And then you can send your patient off to the doctor. Just like a real ambulance so they're gonna really enjoy this this is so cute like i said this was all ten dollars so it came with the mobile clinic the Halley, the Halley the hippo lamby and it came with the little um thing to check the blood pressure which i'm just gonna add over here so they're gonna love this as well you guys i'm running out of so much space this is this is crazy okay we'll sit back there um let me see. The next Doc McStuffin, the next Doc McStuffin thing that they're getting is this, and it's pretty much okay. So this is called the Talk and Trace clipboard, but if you're 20 or older, we call this an etch and sketch. So you just, you know, what an etch and sketch is. You just draw it or whatever. But this one is like, it has like the little 
cutesy stuff that they added on to it. So you, it's called Musical Drawing. So you press this button with Lambie on it and they can listen to music while they're drawing. And when they stop drawing, the music stops. So I thought that was like a really cool spin on the idea of an etching sketch. Um, the next thing that they're getting is another etching sketch, but this one is by Fisher Price. And I'm not exactly sure about what this one. Oh, no, I know what this one is. So this one is to teach, this one promotes handwriting a little more formally than the other one does because this one has the lines on it so they can practice writing their uppercase and lowercase um, letters. Um, and then they have these little letter, letter beads up here that they can like, I guess, play with and move around. And then the stylus on it is a grow with me stylus. So it promotes how to hold a pencil. So I think this one is more educational than the other one is, but this is still really cute. Okay, I'll put that there. Okay, this one is Kylie for Kylie because I know Kylie is going to Kylie is gonna flip over this. If I can give you guys like a description of Kylie in a toy, it would be this. Like this is just so Kylie. When I saw this, I knew this had to be for her. She loves dogs. Like we have three dogs. We have a dog and two puppies right now. And Kylie is like so gentle with them. She loves them. She kisses them all the time. She says that they smell so good. <laughs> she likes the smell of dogs. Like if she can get a perfume that smelled like dogs, I'm pretty sure Kylie would bottle it up and she would savor it. She loves dogs so much. It's like nothing you've ever seen before. Like if you think you're a dog person, oh no, no, no. You have not met Kylie. So and Minnie Mouse is her favorite character as well. So a Minnie Mouse that walks a dog. Oh my goodness. This is going to, she, her eyes are going to like pop out of her head. And I want her to open this last because I know this is going to be a big hit for Kylie. She's going to love this. So Minnie Mouse basically talks and the dog, she like walks her dog and the dog like spins around and walks and stuff. So, oh my goodness. I cannot wait to see her face when she opens this. She's going to be She's going to be beside herself. This is so cute. And because they're both very much into Minnie Mouse, we had to get Kaylee a Minnie Mouse as well. So Kaylee is getting the singing Minnie. And basically this is her Minnie Mouse. And you squeeze, the, and you squeeze her tummy and she sings a song. She has four songs that she sings. So she is going to love this as well. What else is back here? Oh my goodness, I didn't realize they had so much. Okay. So the next thing that they're getting are DVDs. DVDs are always a hit. Um, they love Backyardigan. So my mom found this at a, at a Goodwill. So she picked up the Backyardigans to Into the Deep. And then my brother picked out Dora for them. So they're going to have both of these DVD sets, which they're going to enjoy watching before they go to bed at night. And then the gift that I picked up for them are these Elite Pads. They're both getting leap pads. Kylie is getting the purpley pink one and Kaylee is getting the like lime green one. I found these on eBay for, I believe they were like 26, no, they were about $30 a piece um, plus like $5 shipping. So I found them both one and I'm excited for them to have this. Um, I've already like opened it and downloaded games on it because Back in the day when we had leap pads, we had to use the cartridges, but leap pad now has an app store so you can go online and download the games and you can share them up to five devices. And so I just thought these were like really cool because they grow with the kids. So if like, let's say they're playing a, a game and they get a lot of answers wrong, it'll kind of make the game easier for them to understand. And then once they understand and they start getting everything right, it'll make the game more challenging. So it kind of follows your child's progress, which I think is awesome. So they have this and on the game on the devices they both have two games a uh, a letter game and like a counting slash number game for math. And then with that they're both getting headphones. And we found these these are very inexpensive. We found these at five below. Um so I figured that the littlest pet shop one will go cute with um Kylie's because they're both kind of like the purplish pink color. And then Kaylee has the green and she'll have the pink because I thought those would look really cute together, the pink and the green. So they're getting those. And then, let me see, I think that's pretty much it besides this 
huge gift back here. So let me move this up. Okay. Actually, no, that's not the last gift. This, they're getting this too. You're getting close and you're getting close. So Kate, Kylie's coat is such a pain because it keeps getting stuck. So my mom got her a new coat. This is by Cat and Jack. And we live in Georgia, so they don't really need a thick jacket. This is like perfect for winter down here. And it's just really cute. And it's teal and it has little sparkles. And I love the gold zipper on it. And then because Kylie is getting something that has to do with clothing, Kaylee has to get some clothing too. So she is getting this outfit with the little legging sets. They really, Kaylee really doesn't need this, but because one is getting clothes, the other one has to kind of get clothes too. But um, they get clothes all year round, especially like the day, the students from the daycare. A lot of them are bigger than Kaylee and Kylie. So like when they outgrow things, they'll give it to Kaylee and Kylie. And then I buy them clothes. My mom buy, buys them clothes. So they get clothes like all year round. They really have no more room for clothes, but they're just getting that. And then, okay, I think now we can move on to the big gift. So the big gift that they're getting this year is a new kitchen. Hold on. Okay. They're getting a new kitchen. And this is the Disney. Hold on. I'm going to try to get it together, you guys. Hold on. Okay. This side might be easier to show. Okay. So this is the Disney Princess Magic Kitchen. And it comes with 11 pieces. It's three feet tall. Um, they have the kitchen in their room right now, but it's like brown and white. And the aesthetic in their room is like pink and purple. So this one like matches the room way better. And it's just really cute. They're going to love having a kitchen that's new to them. And um, yeah, I'm so excited for them to open this. So this is probably going to be the last gift they open because this is kind of like their big gift. And they're going to have so much fun. Oh, that, that's kind of heavy too. They're going to have so much fun playing with that and then there was one more thing I wanted to show you guys okay this is something else that that they're getting they are getting passes to stars and stripes which is a bowling alley and then they are getting passes to sparkles which is the ice skating ring and then they had a gift card to Buster's ice cream and it was one more thing in here. Oh, and then catch air, which is like you kind of just jump around. So they have an admission to that. But of course, we're not going to give that to two-year-olds. But they are getting, you know, that as well. And that is everything that they're getting for Christmas. Like I said, I know this is like a lot. But my family, we really do big Christmases and birthdays. We like to celebrate things like that. So, um, and like I said, Kylie and Kaylee, they're blessed enough to have a three-family income. I mean, a three-home income a three income family where they have like you know really older siblings because like we're way older than they are and then of course my mom who loves to spoil her kitties so they're getting all of this for Christmas I hope that you were able to get some ideas on what to get your toddlers for Christmas and that you guys got like some ideas of where to shop most of the stuff is either from Toys R Us Target um thrift, st thrift, sh thrift stores or um Facebook Marketplace so those were the big hits this year, and I'm just so excited to see their little faces when they see the, all their gifts, and I just hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and follow me on Instagram. If you want to see any reviews on anything, like the leap pads or any of the toys that you've seen, leave a comment down below, and I'll be sure to do that after the girls have played with their toys. I can tell you what I think about them, how I feel about them if the kids like them, things like that. So just leave that comment down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Happy holidays!